Hi, I just want to pop in just for a second to give you this quick tip. And you re the reason I'm doing it right now is because I'm in the middle of doing it. And I came upon this problem that trying to cut a really long strip, I would break it. And let me just say, there are a few pieces here that I've already broken and I'm thinking, okay, I've got to come up with a, a way so that these long strips don't break. And so I was coming up with something, something worked, and I thought, I'm going to share that with you. So here we go. So I am making this amazing window that has lots of long strips. So I'm going to show you how to do this. So what I would like to show you, first of all, just to let you know that I already broke a strip, so it's, it's all well and good. So I've got a bunch of these pieces and I need some really long strips, okay? So what I did first was set my strip cutter right at one of these and they're all the same, fortunately. So I'm gonna first dip it in oil here. Okay, first of all, I want to make sure that it's right the way I want it. So you take one of the strips, put my cutting wheel right on the edge. There we go. That should do it. Make sure I've got some oil and I should have some safety glasses. Okay, so I'm going to put this right here. First of all, I am just going to put oil on. That's all I'm doing. Okay. Now, you got to have finesse because you've got a long ways to go. So we're going to push down, pulling toward me. There we go. Okay, here's the deal. So what I found out, and I have broken pieces to prove it, is that when I... When I put the running pliers here, and let me just show you. Oh, it went clear across. <laughs> okay, that's the first time that's happened today. <laughs> All right, usually what's happened is I will, I will press down here and it'll crack about halfway. So then I will get on the other side, bring it back down here, and then use my running pliers to press on this side and it'll come off. Amazing that just because you were here with me today that it came out straight. Okay, do another one. Let's another see. one? Yeah. Let's see if, oh, let's see how we are, if I can do it twice in a row. All right, here we go. That is too funny. Okay, I'm going to make sure, I've got two strip cutters here, so I'm going to make sure I've got the right one. Okay, good. All right. Now, how did, why do you say one is the right one? Oh, because you might be a different size? Might be a different size. Oh, okay. There we go. Rolling it down. Coming towards me. Okay. And hey, if it breaks right the first time, um, that's awesome. <laughs> Maybe you're just getting better at it. Maybe I'm getting better at it. I don't know. Oh. Okay, so there. That's what's been happening to me. All right, so I broke halfway. Not to worry. Coming on this side. Crunching down. Voila. Very good. <laughs> I have had times where I went to squeeze it and it broke it broke here and came off yes and then i had yes. to come back and do it and that's what happened so here are the pieces it kind of it went almost to the end and they just kind of went zoop yeah <laughs> like, okay so you've had that experience <laughs> yeah so anyway just a little tip of the trade so i wanted to show you where these strips were going this design is for a client and this is only just a little piece of it and uh, so as you can see the strips are going right along here it's making a little design kind of a celtic little overflow there and then it'll go and continue 
And on the edge, we're going to do like a Moroccan border. So every one of these squares is going to be something different. So that's going to be fun. Just wanted you to let, to let you know where those strips are going because that's part of the fun. You want to know, you know, I'm just not cutting strips for fun over here. <laughs> Even though it's fun. <laughs> Even though it is fun, yeah. <laughs> so thanks for being with us today for just this little tiny clip. And uh, I hope you'll join us again.